Well, here's the old aluminum truck that Richard shop had the a couple of weeks ago we did, uh, well, Richard changed the front tires on it. Uh, now we're doing some back tires. It's not that the tires were bald, it's just that the car, the truck sat at my backyard for 30 years and kind of got flat spots and weather cracks from the age. So, getting two new, what's this cobweb doing here? I don't know what those headlight rims are, but they fit, so I put them on. Uh, so it's all aluminum. And it's uh, supposed to be a 66 Ford. And, uh, but when we went to do a brake job, it had uh, 65 Ford uh, brakes. So I think what happened was they, uh, they built the chassis in 65 and shipped it off to the company that builds aluminum bodies and they didn't put a body on it until 66 so that's why it's registered as a 66 even though it's got a 65 chassis so Richard's over there hammering on those damn tires and the Mustang is here like I said I got it stuck in first gear So we're going to see if we can't fix this transmission shift and linkage, which I think, I think this one has to be moved back a little bit. Or does it have to go forward? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> let's see. I'm falling back on the... No, it's this one here. It's pulling back to go into first gear. So I want to pull back last, but yeah, I think so. Anyways, we'll worry about that. When it cools, the exhaust is pretty hot, and I don't want to get up in there. So in the meantime, damn. Yeah, a lot more fun than the other one. Yeah, probably stiffer tires. Yeah. Oh no, the, the bead, the, this, the bead this, don't come this apart. thing doesn't want to come apart as easy as the other ones did. Yeah. I mean, is it, does it mean it's better? Probably, but <laughs> <laughs> better's not really better right now. <laughs> yeah, it's better when it's on there, but not, not too much. Not right now. Oh yeah. That edge is about ready to break off. This is? Yeah, that tip. Oh, oh the I tip. That. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This guy in there. there. And then this guy right in here. Knock it that way. Oh, yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, some more. Get a bit more, yeah. Maybe I gotta go this way. Come on. Damn that thing, I want to let go. Right. Alright, some more. Which one? That one. Oh, hey, it's moving. I think we we'll moved a little Again. bit. One? No. Yeah, if you want to tap on that one. Okay, now drive that one a little bit more. You can move that up inside the way. This? That, that, yeah, prop there. You can get that out there. Thank you. Yeah. Come on. Oh, there it goes. Come on. Almost. <laughs> Careful. No, right? Spring up and hit Hopefully you in the face. Hopefully it doesn't freaking take me out. Yeah. yeah.
we've gotten somewhere. Yep. Just not. Yeah. Walks in ready to come. Sure does look like it. <laughs> oh. Did it give? Uh, it looks like I felt like it. Out it. A little more, but... yeah. Finally. Yeah. Wow. I think that was it. Yep. There it is. <laughs> That'll take you. That'll teach me to save 50 bucks. <laughs> oh, it wasn't that bad last time. <laughs> oh, I want to tell you. I want to tell you. Look, I brought an extra. I said, no. I said, might change his mind. I think it's this. Well, usually the way we work it is at this shop is, well, you know, the, the size of the tire and how much weight we use. Yeah. So it's yeah. 17 inches, usually 17 bucks. So I said, well, we're splitting the rim apart, so 25. Yeah, it's a little more, right? <laughs> yeah. I'm just looking in case there's a little ooh, there's a burr. Yeah, right there. I can, I can grind it. Yeah. yeah. You don't have to try to do that. I'll grind it too. Yeah. So. To oh, that's extra. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Figure, just gotta keep working at it, working at it. It'll work. I'm hoping the other one comes off easier. Yeah. Me too. I got lots to do today. <laughs> I know. Figures, John, bring his junk over. Yeah. 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 Uh, my fault too. You know, I told you, sure, bring it over. <laughs> well, it, it didn't go like the other one. Once you figured it out, the other one was came went yeah pretty decent. You know, it wasn't easy, but it wasn't like this. You know. Yeah. Red. You get any red? I um, the little box, the cardboard box in the floor. I'm pointing right at it. Oh yeah. Get some rags in. The bead is broken already. It's just going to come out. Yeah. Yeah. So these are these. Second wheel came. The second yeah. wheel was easier than the first. How old are you, Richard? I am 49 now. 49? I think I'm not 47. 47? No, 48. Four, I think I'm 48 now. Okay, I, can't, I, I, I lost count. 48. You know? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> after, I, after 45, I just kind of stopped counting. So. I know. I lose track sometimes of how old I am. I was at the eye doctor's. What are you, like 60? I'm just close. I the eye doctors and I told him I was 48 and he, 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 was, he, he was sitting on there on his computer. Well, from the looks of my computer, you're actually 47 still. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, you know more than I do. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm 79, but sometimes I think I'm 89. 79, uh -huh. huh? Yeah. It's like everybody, when you're going to be 80? Uh, March. 
Oh, next year, huh? Next year. Oh, Jesus. You better have a big party over your house, huh? Yeah. Have I'm, all the I'm, other cars show up. And, you know. I'm hoping that, uh, you know, people will take it seriously because nobody ever, nobody ever does anything for my birthday. They just kind of ignore it. So I figure oh, oh. when you turn 80, I figure you ought to have a party because you may not make 81. No, I mean, you know what? When my mother turned 80, we had a big party for her because, what is it? You want to put your mouth on? What? Because I see holes in it. Oh, so what? <laughs> it's got another 100,000 in it. Right? Yeah. <laughs> it might, <have> <laughs> might sound tough, though. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, everybody's just too uh, surprised to see one on the road anyways to even worry about what it sounds like. This yeah. thing, I was like, wow, that thing's a wreck. I'm not kidding mm. you, I was going down Hancock Pond Road, right, in Sebago, and uh, I see these people I know, and they're out there, and uh, <laughs> yeah. I pull up, and the guy's just laughing, and he's looking, and he goes, oh, it's shit, it's John. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, what the hell is this thing? And I said... Wow. Well, come to find out, he didn't realize this was left hand, left hand threads. I huh. didn't. Yeah. He started to go take them off. They're not coming off. This is harder than. It's like uh, I saw that. I saw the lug was turned. I was like, go the other way. Yeah. <laughs> the same thing with my Jeep. It's the same thing. How come? I don't know. No, that was a, some theory that somebody had that. Uh, they could loosen up if they're turned in one way, but not the other way. It was kind of stupid. I don't think they loosen up no matter which way they go on. Yeah. I don't know why they did it without actually experimenting first to see if the... Put those back in. Yeah. Yeah, probably just experimenting first. Experimenting. Uh -huh. Probably. Come on, baby. seen it sitting in the backyard for 30 odd years waiting for the owner to come back for it. Yeah, his brake well, right like, brake light worked for about a second. There you go. There it is. <laughs> well. Interesting, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah.